Right, so yesterday I cleaned up the entire house and in the process of course I cleaned up the gaming setup. Now I snapped a, pi a quick picture because this setup is probably never gonna look this good again so since I've never really done a setup tour I think that I'm gonna do one now but it's just gonna be basically this picture. So we're gonna go through what we have over here. I mean, I could do a video where I record everything, but again, the setup is already starting to get dirty, so yes, a picture is all we get for now. So, this is what we have. Our couple's setup. I mean, it's fairly cheap. Most of it is like Ikea and hand-me-down parts and uh, that kind of stuff, but uh, I mean, if we start off with my section, I mean, we have a Samsung... I've already forgotten the name of the monitor, S5 or something. Yeah, I do believe it's the Odyssey G5. I believe this main monitor is 30 inches. Fairly big, but I do enjoy having a lot of, uh, you know, play area. As for peripherals, we have the, let's see, I mean, I can just look down, G910 keyboard from Logitech. It's been my keyboard for pretty much like over a decade. It also has a phone holder, which I find useful, and also, I, I mean, you can't really see by, uh, with the picture. I'm, I've taken a picture with my wife's phone, since the camera on my phone is, well, even crappier than this, but, uh, yes. I do prefer Logitech peripherals, as well as the mouse, which is the G502, I believe. Now, before this, I think I had, like, the G9, and for the keyboard, it was the G19, I think. Yeah, the good old membrane keyboards. No, oh, let's see, yeah, the microphone is just a Blue Yeti, I've had it forever, still works, works great. And the webcam that I'm using right now, I, oh, I should really have been more prepared. Is it like the G920 or the G900? Yeah, I mean, it, 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 it works, that it does. Now, the computer is a fairly hefty one, the case is from NZXT. I think it's the Phantom Tower, one of the biggest ones. I do need room, especially since I have uh, quite a hefty, uh, hefty graphics card. It's the RTX 4080. Got it as a Christmas present from the wife a couple of years ago. Other than that, I, 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 I mean, again, I could just look up the specs, but I'm going off memory. I do believe my process, processor is the i9 uh, 10900K. Uh, I mean, you could overclock it. I haven't done overclocking in many a years since, well, uh, I, I don't really have to. Right, and at the bottom we have the weights that I barely use. And as for the desk and cabinet, I mean, I believe these are called the Alex drawers and everything else is just, you know, the cheap IKEA stuff. As well as the cup holders, which are fairly good. Now for the wife's setup, there's kind of a funny story because I did want an all pink setup for her. I mean, I could technically paint uh, the monitors and, of course, the speakers and such, but yeah. Wanted a pink keyboard and a pink mouse. Now, the pink keyboard was like uh, 20 bucks or something, but the mouse, you can see that it is a Razer mouse. Now, this little bastard was $150. <laughs> uh, yeah, we also have a fairly big taxation on electronics in my country, so yeah, the prices are indeed inflated. Now, a couple of months ago, I saw a deal for 30 bucks, you could get a pink keyboard and a pink mouse. Yeah, for, for just 30 bucks. So, <laughs> uh, yeah. As for my wife's case, it's the, was it Corsair or, uh, now probably the Cooler Master Half XB. Now, for the cable management, I mean, I've done the best that I can with what we have, but yeah, there's a tiny little spider web over here, and on my wife's side, I mean, I, just, I didn't put too much effort into. Uh, the cable management. No, I usually do, but if, if, you know, we had just moved it, basically, and I haven't touched it in uh, years. But yeah, we have a little bit of uh, Horde mug, World of Warcraft. Nice. We have a uh, digital watch. Useful to tell the time. Yes, and also wireless uh, charging station for the phone, because my charger or my phone does not want to charge with a cable, because it's broken and it's old. Uh, it's a Galaxy S9. Now, prior to this, I had a S4. And prior to that again, I had a LG Q... No, LG KU990. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't really upgrade stuff unless I absolutely have to. 
let's see, and as for the shelf above, a couple of pictures of me and the wife, some Minecraft Legos, that's the cat doorbell that chimes in whenever my cat wants to go inside, that's baby arriving on a snowmobile, some roses that I bought for the wife for Valentine's Day a couple of years ago, uh, a pocket watch that I got from my mother on my 18th birthday, uh, computer smurf, yes, black spider-man, and a reindeer uh, candle light holder. Also, you need a green plant just to get some greenery. Here we have Geralt of Rivia. I think it's like an amiibo. I'm not sure. Got it as a Christmas present a long time ago. And can't really see because of the quality of the camera or quality of the picture. But that's a Lego Deadpool and an LTT water bottle. Now, yeah, I mean, it's not an expensive setup. As for my speakers, they're the creative ones. She has the Logitech ones because I do not care about uh, uh, sound quality. I think I'm very tone deaf, so doesn't really matter. We do also each have headphones, but hers is behind the monitor and mine is behind this monitor. Yeah, but everything is rather cheap, except for, of course, the uh, parts in my computer. I mean, my wife got my old uh, graphic card, which was the GTX 980 Ti. Yeah, there's a few generations <laughs> between them. Now, before that, my wife had uh, GTX, uh, I do believe it was 6080s in SLI. Barely worked. I mean, she could uh, barely play any games. I mean, the most, we mostly we played Minecraft and uh, games like that, but yeah. She needed an upgrade. She bought me an upgrade. So she got my old parts. And also there's my diploma from college. Extremely expensive piece of paper. Uh, it's more expensive than all of this put together. Oh yeah, and of course also the Steel Series <laughs> RGB mal uh, mouse mat. Uh, yeah, uh, I mean I did have uh, quite a bit of money back when I bought this setup, but uh, I mean it's many a years ago. Actually, I do have an old picture. Give me a second. Yeah, here we have when I was living with my brother. Oh, this is many years ago, way before I met my wife. Yeah, you can still see that I have. That's her monitor. That is my side monitor. These monitors are currently in the attic because I don't really know what to do with them. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I still have the same keyboard. Uh, yeah, same mouse, same mouse pad. Oh yeah, there's the phone. That's the Galaxy S4 and the same case, of course, with different parts. Yeah, I use this computer for basically rendering and I also did attempt to live stream uh, a little bit. So it was my streaming computer. Oh yeah, but this is an old, oh, old picture. I was young back then. Yeah, I think I did some minor web development on the side, if I remember correctly. That's the PlayStation 4. Played that a little bit. And yeah, here you can see that yeah, the cable management is a lot better. I mean, there's a few cables here, but that's from the uh, headset. I mean, I did also make an entire video <laughs> uh, that I posted on YouTube when I upgraded this headset. To a headset that didn't work and then I just wound up uh, fixing this one. I mean, this is the headset I, that I still use. Now, and here's the cat and yeah, again, <laughs> this is not the best cable management. I mean, I attempted to do something, but yeah, this is back when, actually, I do think I have another picture. Oh, hang on, I did clean it up a little bit better here, but yeah, look how cozy it was. Uh, and this was before we put in the IKEA desks and such. I mean, my wife's setup is like, she barely had room for two monitors. And now, since we have removed one, she didn't want two monitors anymore, since she only uses one. And we don't really have that much time to play, so, yeah, she has a little bit more room now. Yes, oh, this was very cozy. Oh yeah, I do have a picture of the setup from quite some time ago. Here you can see that my wife did have two monitors. But, yeah, it looks a lot cleaner now. But yeah, also the reason for making this video is that, well, I thought about making one since me and the wife are currently contemplating on where we're supposed to put the setup. Or we're at least gonna split the setup up since, well, this is an, in the middle of the living room. And we do need the space since, uh, well, we have a child and another one on the way. So yeah, this should rather be a play area or something. So my wife has bought two more legs so that she can remove her part of the setup and move it somewhere else and i'm not sure where i'm supposed to put mine i mean we're thinking the bedroom but the bedroom is already well there's already stuffed to the brim with the bed and the crib so well i mean yeah, that's that's gonna be a challenge i mean we're still gonna play together it's just that we don't necessarily have to be in the same room 
Uh, my wife is laughing at that, but yeah, yeah, I mean, that's just a part of growing up. Now, I must say that I'm extremely lucky to have a wife that, well, is okay with having a PC set up in the middle of the living room. I mean, that's the couch, and the TV is right over here. Here's the dining area. Oh, yes, so it's the centerpiece uh, of our abode. So there you have it, that's my and my wife's gaming setup. Now, hopefully you found this a little bit entertaining. I do know that I enjoy looking at other people's setups. So, yeah, here's uh, here's mine. As le at least how it's gonna look for a little bit until we uh, basically split it in half. I will probably have to move the Alex drawers more to the side. And, uh, yeah, there's gonna be... It's gonna be interesting where we're supposed to fit all of this. I mean, yeah... Uh, Probably the bedroom, maybe, maybe just maybe. So uh, there's a chance that the sound quality might ch change if I need to put myself into a closet or something. Now that's something that I could potentially do. There was a lot of content creators and streamers that just put themselves in a closet because of the echoes and like the natural uh, sound muffling that you get. Uh, but we will see. Anyhow, I think that I'm gonna say, as always, until next time.